Hello and welcome to Nightly Nerds. I'm Tote. And I'm Ginger. And we're playing Stardew Valley. Yay! We are back on the toilet farm with a Giggle Turd. <laughs> giggle Turd. Who named that guy? You did. Oh, that's right. Anytime I'm playing, you have naming rights. Oh. Okay. So in the settings, there is a particular settings for use controller style menus. Ah, oh, because you were using like the mouse style? And so when you turn that off and you can, you know, you can, everything is mouse related. So I could then, add, instead of being forced to throw something away, I can go, it's on the ground. Ah. So I don't have to necessarily trash something if I need to, if I can come back and get it later. All right. What do we got here? What do we got in the mail? <gasps> the mail. Oh, he got a new deluxe fishing pole. That's right. Cause we hit, we hit level two with our fishing. Let's go visit <laughs> Willie. So I, I was going to say, I, I, I learned something the other day. One of those little things you get to learn every day. Get smarter every day, everybody. Smarter. It's a good channel. It's a great channel. It's a great channel. But uh, is it Dustin his name? Yes. Uh, one of the things... Or I, Destin, sorry. Destin. Destin. I didn't learn this on there, though. But I learned this the other day. Uh, what brought it up for me is before we start recording, we always do a little sync because we record our audio separately so we can have we have nicer mics. We don't want to go into the, the capture card in case it screws something up. Yeah. So we have it all separate and then we put it together later. So we have to do a sync. So we just line up a menu, do countdown. So we lined it up when we're doing the editing. And there's another thing called a clap sync. You know, you've all seen one, that two, three, clap sync. You know, there's also like scene one, da da da. That's where that comes from. Yeah. So you can line up your audio and video. And oh, she's building a coop for us. This this week, I didn't want to clap. We don't have to do a clap sync, but we do it as a joke. Yeah. We, we actually do. don't have video right now. I know some people want face cam, but we don't do it right now. And because uh, Larry is camera shy. Not really, but. <laughs> um, there's a snap I did. I did a snap in instead. And then I learned recently that when you snap, it's actually not your fingers that make the noise. It's the it's impact. your hand. It's your yeah. It's your finger that you're snapping off your thumb on that slaps your yeah, slaps your it's, hand. It's the impact. Yeah. So I, it's the, 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 as someone who's learned to snap when he was like four or five, I just figured it out one day. Like practicing in my room by myself. That's the kind of kid I was. <laughs> um, I didn't Loser think about kid. it. I just figured out how to do it. I never thought about how it worked. And then, like, Aww. then there's those people who don't know how to snap. They're like, I don't know how to snap. It's because they're trying to make the noise on their fingers. Yeah. So you have to teach them. It's not that. You're slapping the meat on your hand with your finger. Yeah, like, if you just do that, you're not really making a sound. Yeah. I'm, I'm snapping. I mean, we probably are picking that up, but it's just kind of funny. I know. I'm pretty sure a lot of people are like, duh, tote, you're an idiot. <laughs> but I'm well, sure there are other people going, like, mind's blown. Like, oh, my gosh, it's not my fingers. Well, it's like, I, I learned that oh, we have, like, no, I don't know why I'm visiting Willie. I don't have any freaking money for a freaking But he's got a new fishing ball, a fiberglass rod. It's really good, too, because I can take this, actually, as an example, I can take this monster meat. And, oh, you can make bait. And I can make bait. We learned that it. last time, I think, right? Yeah. But, yeah. What was that? Oh, that's right. We're going to go take this ancient seed to <gasps> the library. I don't think library. I don't think I've done this on this playthrough. No, I don't think so. I don't remember what we did last. Um, we did the Easter egg hunt. Yeah, we had the Easter egg hunt. It's it's been it's been a couple weeks for us. We had uh We had holidays and sicknesses. And sicknesses. I I'm still slightly sick. I'm I, not sick anymore. And I say slightly as in like I just had like I woke up earlier this week. And I, like I had a, like that annoying swelling in like the lymph nodes in your throat. Yeah. And they can push up on your eardrum, and I was just not having it. I was just like, you know what? Oh yeah, your ears are like plugged, but yep. not really. Well, no, it's it's that it ached and it ringed. Oh, okay. And so I'm like, I cotton swabs in the ear. I'm probably gonna uh, probably gonna be complete and utter crap. Cotton swabs, not cotton swabs. <laughs> you got little Q-tips in your ears. <laughs> cotton ball, I mean. <laughs> And it just, I was going to be like, I'm, I'd be complete and utterly worthless for uh, recording. And it was just like, no. Screw. And then I was sick too. Yeah. Okay, so the the library here, if we talk to Gunther, Gunther, we can donate things in the museum. Typically minerals, fancy stuff like that. Like we can take, uh, I believe this is Topaz. And if we build up enough stuff here he'll give us something yeah. later on oh you're such a good contributor to the but library if we turn in certain things like we turned in that ancient seed pigs on we blanket. now get an ancient seed Ooh, candy corn <laughs> get, just now, doing all the german accents yes i know getting you we get an ancient seed as an actual crop Have that we you can grow ever seen is it 20? and now a recipe sorry cut you off 20 is it 23 weeks 
Can't say that I have. What's the zombie one? Is that 28 Days? No idea. 20 Days Later? Never seen either of them. Either I think there's one called them. 20... Is it 28 Days? 28 I know which one I know which one you're talking about, but... Sandra Bullock is the one I'm talking yeah. about. It's oh. like, it's a... Sandra Bullock, my first crush. Oh, yeah. I'm there with you. There's some people who don't like her. I still... I love Sandra I still Bullock. still rail that. No. Because, <laughs> you know, she's like, oh, give me some of that tote. No, but... Uh, no, I would. You Okay, you want it. It's right here. No, <laughs> <laughs> Buy me dinner first. Oh, uh, but uh, it's not like you haven't before. <laughs> <laughs> bottom dinner, bottom, bottom dinner, people. No, no, that's not what he's saying. All right, um, well, uh, not completely forgot what I was gonna say. <laughs> oh, did, oh, twenty eight. Did, did I get you all hot and bothered over there? I, oh, twenty eight. It's a movie about rehab, <laughs> right? It's kind of a rom com. Like she goes into rehab, but she's an alcoholic. Uh huh. And she's got this rich boyfriend who's also kind of an alcoholic, and he's totally an enabler. Like he likes her drunk, okay, but she doesn't so. know that. And she falls in love with a guy in rehab, but it's totally not going to work because that's not what you go to rehab. And they kind of acknowledge it towards the end. Yeah. Not to give away too much spoilers. This movie's probably like twenty years old. <laughs> Spoiler, Twenty-eight days old. These, uh, but uh, Alan Tudyk's in it. Oh, I, I think Alan Tudyk. I don't want to get it wrong, but I'm ninety-nine percent sure. Ninety-nine percent percent sure that. Uh, uh, Sid Myers did uh, Sim City too, <laughs> and he did. He, he I was thinking helped. Civilization. Uh, he did help on some Sim games of the of that genre. But anyways, um, we're just gonna go bankrupt on parsnips. All the parsnips. Hey, it's investing for the future. So that's a long con. Well, so the, uh, I I had oh, oh do I have salad for you? I don't have salad for you. I'm oh, sorry. Oh, Leah. that's our ga- gal we're going I'm for. I'm sorry, right? Leah. We She's don't... an artist. I mean, we haven't given her any gifts this week, so we got to do that later. Um, but anyways, he does a German, like... Oh, yeah. Uh, he's also in the rehab, and he's like this gay German guy. He's like super sad, and <laughs> it, was like, it was like one of those things where I didn't know it was him when I first saw the movie, because I was younger and didn't really know who Alan Tudyk was, and then... Alan Tudyk's amazing. Saw it later on when he still wasn't as big as he is now, but then I knew who he was, and it was like, oh, this is, he's fantastic. Now I have to pull my phone out and make sure it's actually him. <laughs> and I just spout a bunch of garbage about some other actor who's like getting his credit taken away. Okay, so we got a, we got three days to make money. Sweet, I'm gonna get that. Uh, I got a 3D printer, everybody. My brother just sent me a message. I'm getting some of that flex uh, filament stuff. We should we should uh, we should get those those uh, character avatars made and make those into figurines yeah, for D and D. Ooh, oh. We'll have a Toten Ginger. A Toten Ginger. Minis. We'll have to make specific characters. I went to for the school. That. I went to art school and I learned how to do the 3D stuff. And now I'm wasting my life and not using it. But <laughs> uh, but I'm doing it for fun on the side. I, I, I as, as much as I've been playing this at home on my own spare time, I love this freaking music. Oh, it's it's cool music. It's like so peppy and like it changes based yeah. off where you're I think at. It's, I think it's 28 weeks. I, checking yeah so i learned a couple a couple of little tricks or 28 days i know which movie you're talking about well, but i'm trying to remember the exact name because like you get i remember there's like a joke that people would get confused with the zombie movie yeah 28 28 days later yeah. is the first one and 28 weeks is the second one and so people were like would Thinking they were getting the zombie movie instead of get a, a rom com from the nineties with Sandra Bullock. <laughs> Twenty eight days is what it's called. Okay, so we're gonna store away this ancient seed because it's too late for me to profit from it. We're gonna grab all but a one of Ooh, each. Thirty one percent of rotten tomatoes. <laughs> Uh, just throw it out there. I wasn't the one actually watching the movie. It was one of my. I have two older sisters, so I watched a lot of rom coms as a kid. Uh huh. And I still watch them today on my own. But he loves them. I love them. Oh, I love period pieces. You give me a good I. like BBC period oh, piece. Oh, I'm all over of, that. We need to. Uh, we need to watch the new season of Vikings. I'm so behind. That's not really a period piece, is it? No, but I mean, it's, it's, it's historical. When I say period piece, I mean like Victorian age. No, I know, I know age. what you mean. Sometimes they're in America, but usually England. We're talking like uh, Pride and Prejudice. Yeah, I got you. All over Pride and Prejudice. So you like Anne of Green Gables? Yes, I do. Really? I don't, I don't love it. I don't know if we can be friends. <laughs> I there's, there's things I like more. Uh, Jane Eyre. Jane Pride Eyre's and Prejudice. Um, 
Sense and Sensibility, Little Women even, that's an American one. Um, I know you don't like what's your name. Uh, help me out here. I don't know. I want to see if you can figure this out. Um, Winona Ryder. Oh, yeah, no. Winona Ryder. I don't really like Winona? her. Winona? Winona? Winona. I don't know. Her acting I've heard is both just... Ways. Eh. For you. Yeah, Alan Tudyk. I had it right. He was in it. Sorry, everybody. That's where I... He was in 28 Days. He's the gay German man. He's fantastic. No, that's... I remember for some reason no, he got, seemed really tall in it. I don't know how tall Alan Tudyk is. He's Let's not that very up. tall. How tall is Alan Tudyk? I know he's shorter than Will Wheaton. But is Will Wheaton tall? Fairly. I believe he's uh, six foot. That's not tall. Okay, compared to me, it's not tall. Compared to you, that it's not tall, but the average size in yes. the United States, that is tall. Five ten. Alan Tudyk is six foot. Is he six foot? Well, I mean, he's Hollywood six foot, so he could be 5'11". I mean, maybe compared to Sandra Bullock, he's tall. I remember that. They made him seem like a big, tall, blonde German man. At least they didn't make him a... Uh... Well, not Lord like of the Rings Will tall. <laughs> like Treebeard or something? Well, I mean, just like... I know, like... Uh, camera angling and stuff. Yeah, yeah. Force perspective. Yes, force perspective. Okay. Okay, Will Wheaton is... Will Wheaton? Oh, he's shorter. He's 5'11". Is he short? Okay, I'm going to have it backwards. Okay, but he they could actually be the same height because even though Will Wheaton is in Hollywood, he's not as Hollywood as Toot Dick is now. Yeah. He's more uh, nerdist popular. I mean, he does do um, Big Bang Theory. Big Bang Theory, but which, funny enough, people in the nerd community hate. <laughs> I, I think that's I, hilarious. I liked it. Uh, I had it had moments for me, but once it once it became the nerds and their gal pals, I was done with it. Yeah, and then it, and it literally became like a friend ripoff. I think it's funny. What's funny to me is there's people out there like who hate it because they think it makes fun of nerd culture, and it does. But like they see it as like almost like. Like a racial slur against nerds in a way. Well, and they I, get that angry about it. I'm like, man, they're such like they're so much, they're acting so much like Sheldon or something when they yeah. get that angry about it. Yeah. I mean, and there's people who like do the whole thing where they take out the laugh track and like, look how dumb it is. It's not even funny. It's like you could do that to like Cheers, a show that was hilarious. Take the laugh track out. There's gonna be awkward pauses. Yeah. Because they have to pause for the laugh for the for the audience to laugh. Yeah. And then they have to pump up that with a laugh with a laugh track. Pump but up the jam. Pump it up. People are just jealous because that's what's his name. He's making a ton of money. Who? The producer of it. Oh. He did. Yeah. Uh, he did that. He did. Um, oh yeah, because I remember. Two we... and a half men. Oh. He I, did. Yeah. He does. I think he does. Two bro. Chuck Lorre. Chuck yeah, Lorre. Is it Lorre or Lorre? Lore. Yeah, that dude's got. Dude, he's just I remember his own money. I embarrassingly died in the dun Yeah, you in, did. In I kept telling you you should probably do something. You didn't, then you died to like the slime. Yeah, and apparently it's like a suicide if you actually keep yourself dead in the dungeons and you don't just reload your save. Ah. Because it's like complete and utter suicide for new people to have that happen. So don't do that. Yeah, like I said, I, I learned I learned tricks. I learned things to. To make my life better, I know. I was letting you have your your rant, and I did. It wasn't a rant that yeah. time. It, it was, was just, a rant. I was just talking. I was happy. Anytime you go talk, lucky. it's a rant. Okay, we're gonna leave the mine, and we're gonna go to bed. All right, and that'll end this episode. All right, but yeah, so we'll catch you in the next episode. I'm Tote, and I'm Ginger. See you then. Hey, did you like that video? Well, if you did, click the box on the right for another. Click the box on the left for a playlist. Of course, you could always just subscribe by clicking the link in the middle. Come find us on social media. There are links in the description below. Don't be afraid to leave us a comment. Thanks for watching. I'm Tote. I'm Ginger. See you then. Bye.